Hello my beautiful Sagittarius. Happy New Year. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. Trying Divine Tarot. I'm trying. I'll be reading for you today. Okay. <laughs> Our message is going to be a little shorter because I'm trying to do the whole zodiac in one day. And we're going to do a little prediction for my Sagittarius for 2024. I'm using Romance Angels and I'm also using the Leah Normand. Okay. For my Sagittarius please. See what we got going on here. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. All right. If you're in a relationship now, I think you're calling it quits, uh, Sagittarius. I think you're cutting something off, okay, with the synth here. <laughs> I think that's the way it goes. It's just showing up backwards on my crazy camera. Okay, so yeah, you know why? Because I think you found chemistry with somebody else. All right. I think you met somebody that really gets the juices flowing. That um, you just really enjoy their companionship. But um, I think you want to be more than friends, Sagittarius, or vice versa. Let's read the message on the card. It says, chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. So, yeah. You think they're so hot. They think you're so hot. Okay. <laughs> Let me look how close they're sitting. I mean, they're like all over each other. <laughs> and they're happy. So, but I do believe one of you could have been in a relationship when you met each other. Okay. And realized that that wasn't for you. Because when you came together with your person, it was just like sparks, you know, sparks flew. Okay. Yep. Here it is. Flirt. <laughs> this started off with a little flirting and then it's just, it's like really evolving to so much more. Okay. Like you can't deny your feelings for this person. It says flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. <laughs> and I think that's what you did. <laughs> And as you can see, it's almost the same picture, okay? He, they're sitting very, very, you know, side by side on a bench, you know, kind of whispering in each other's ears, flirting. And then here it is with like the magnetic attraction. You two are sitting super close. You're really cozying up to each other, Sagittarius, okay? <laughs> All right. Yeah, because it's divine timing. Here's the compass, Okay. It's like a destined event. If it hasn't happened, it's it's on its way, okay? And you might have to um, release something that's going to allow this energy to flow easily and naturally, okay? You may have been, um, with the owls here, um, yeah, this could be a past life connection. That's why like the, the magnetism is so strong, okay? Because you recognize each other. There's two owls in this tree, okay? And um, they're very wise. They're very seasoned. And at this point, they know what love is and what love isn't. And like I said, something has to be released so you can be with the person that sets your soul on fire, okay? <laughs> um, they could have been your opposites okay opposites attract or they maybe this was like an online connection okay and they live in a different state or a different country different town but obviously there was some distance here okay um maybe the bridge is this closer bridge is representing you and this bridge all the way back here is representing maybe where they're from but i feel like the gap is closing and i feel like you guys want to walk <laughs> you want to cross the bridge okay to each other I just, I'm just feeling like two energies like you're here and they're here and then you guys you guys meet in the middle okay it's like you got the coordinates okay this is what you're guided to do here with the compass yeah here it is traveling here it is at the boat <laughs> so um 
like I feel like the recognition is so strong that like you guys may just date for like a month or two and then end up just eloping and that's just the energy I'm receiving and it does happen that way for some people so people can judge how they want to judge this is your life and this is your story Sagittarius okay and you do what you want and what feels right to you so it says honeymoon enjoy the bliss of holiday time together and that's where we're in we're in holiday time okay so <laughs> maybe you're you are receiving a proposal maybe at the stroke of midnight okay <laughs> maybe this happened over christmas um or maybe you guys are just you know floating off into the sunset okay and like I said, you guys, are, you you have the coordinates and 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 in the direction. I mean, this is like the six of swords, okay, where you're leaving the past behind and you're going towards your happiness. And I'm really feeling that vibe off of this energy. And your happiness is the person that you've been flirting with and you have all this chemistry with, okay. And whatever you decide to do, it's going to be a really really lucky move for you with the clover. This is the luckiest energy in this deck, okay. So with the clover, you can't go wrong. When this, this you know, besides the sun uh, card in this deck, the clover is what represents the happiness. So, wow. It's just, it's just like, and also like this luck, it's like a destined event. Of it, like with this luck, like a lucky shot, a lucky chance that you ran into each other. And you could have ran into each other outside, okay? This represents outdoor, an outdoor event, okay? And inside this is like one of those um, indoor gardens. And this is how they saw you. They came across you. They passed like this. <laughs> I don't know what you, if you were in a store or a storefront or, or you could have like an online. I don't know. Somehow they were able to view you. And in inside of this... Um, this garden house are the most beautiful flowers you've ever seen. So you really caught their eye, Sagittarius, and they had like <laughs> they had to approach you, okay? They walked up the stairs and they checked you out and then the rest is going to be history, all right? So you definitely have um some exciting passionate energy around you it's going to carry off into the 2024 and this is a compass but it also is resembling a wedding band <clears throat> for me okay so i feel like this relationship is really going to kick itself up a few notches in 2024 all right so I'm going to leave it there for my Sagittarius. I'm feeling this is a really lucky and love situation. And I just feel like it's going to prosper into something really beautiful. All right, Sagittarius. I'm going to leave it here. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I greatly appreciate that. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. It lets you know every time I upload a video. And until next time, baby dolls, see you next year. Ciao.